Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today, I'm on call. And I've already had two calls for the patient monitoring system for close to the same problem, and they're both avoidable. How do you avoid this kind of thing? Well, I'm gonna show you. This is a standard RJ45 connector on an ethernet cable. If you see, it's got a long plastic piece that allows you to remove it from the wall box. These are angle cutters. What I'm gonna do, this guy right here. So you take your RJ45, take your angle cutters, I want you to cut this guy off right after the latch. See that? It's magical. Watch this. When the RJ45 goes in, there's no way for a normal person to get it back out. So nurses and EVS, they can't get the cable back out, which will make the system disconnect with the server. If a biomed needs to get the connector back out, you just take any instrument and you shove it down on the lock assembly that should be just about flush with the port and you can get it out. See that? That is how you eliminate an amazing amount of calls related to client bedside systems disconnecting to the server and causing all sorts of headaches for you. I can't even tell you how many nights I've spent in on calls because uh, biomeds who are responsible for the nurse call system will refuse to do that simple little task that I just did. Now on a normal bedside monitor, it's a permanent install. There's no need to be disconnecting those cables. And if you do need to disconnect them, using a tool is actually a pretty simple request. So guys, let's eliminate some of these crazy, ridiculous work orders and just cut the tabs off your RJ45 connectors and you'll save everybody a lot of headache and a lot of downtime. That's all I got for you today. This is my daily blog from Better Biomed. Thanks guys.